May. It's a baby shower. You're invited. The invitation comes from a baby's closet, which is part of Associated Churches. This baby shower uh, is uh, to help lower infant mortality rates. And to tell us more about that and a baby's closet, we have Dr. Deb Mann, and, uh, who's the Allen County Health Commissioner, and Irini uh, from Associated Churches. Uh, good to have you both here. Let's start off with Allen County. Do we not do well in this category? Sadly, no. Our hmm. infant mortality rate is, is fairly high. We're usually number two in the state. So our infant mortality rate is unacceptably high. Wow, I didn't realize it was that yeah, bad. Yeah. Uh, now, um, I guess, how does this tie in with what you guys do with the, a baby's closet? Well, definitely a baby's closet um, helps support um, single women or even married women that are struggling uh, financially. So we have incentive programs that we offer um, to help with breastfeeding needs, to help with um, the safe sleep program that we have, um, just to educate women um, to better serve them as mothers. So they have the incentives, they have the coupons, and then they can purchase much needed baby items. So some of this is, you know, the whole back to sleep and things like that. and, mm -hmm. and, and learning and having the proper equipment, cribs. I know some of the video I see you guys uh, with some new cribs things like that. What is that what we're going for? Exactly. It's mainly the incentive to educate them and then once they're educated they can earn those coupons to actually purchase those needed items. Nice. And so you see this making a difference, right? I think it's really important. I think in public health we're always looking for ways to people for people to feel socially connected. Uh, we don't usually do very well in that in ratings either. And I think a baby's closet is a way for moms to feel connected to the folks around them and it's really an opportunity just to really bring some joy into their life. I think sometimes when you're in the baby's closet when you're in that situation sometimes you feel like uh, you know it's kind of a struggle but this is just pure joy you get to go in there and you get to be happy about the baby talk about the baby get things for the baby it's really a time of joy which really should be a time of joy when a new baby's coming into absolutely, the world absolutely absolutely uh, so uh, has this been going on a long time I feel like this is the first time I've really heard about it yeah we do it annually okay. the community-wide baby shower um, and so this year we're doing it a little bit different so we had a week-long <clears throat> excuse me a week-long drop-off um, and and so tomorrow will be the last day until 6 p.m. Um, the community is welcome to drop off uh, baby items, cribs, car seats, um, clothing, diapers, um, wipes. We welcome it all. Mm -hmm. um, and obviously it doesn't end there. Um, you can continue to drop off throughout the year um, because the need is still there. So. Yeah. I, I don't know how many years ago it was that I was stunned to learn that, you know, things like food stamps don't pay for diapers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, it was a little taken aback by that because it just seems like, you know, okay, that seems like a good thing, actually, right. but you guys are, are step in and, and mm -hmm. fill a lot of need that people have. Yeah. yeah. So uh, if people want to drop off, is there a specific location? And, and are we talking like with cribs, things like that need to be new or? The cribs do need to be new and we okay. prefer the car seats are new as well. Right. Um, and they can come to our location at 602 East Wayne Street and you can go to our website and get an exhaustive list of the things that we need at associatedchurches.org. If people want to, uh, they're watching this and they're like, okay, maybe I, I'm not in a position to donate, but I sure could use some help. Same mm -hmm. website, same type things? Definitely. Um, they can get our contact information from there and from there we will give them the information on how they need to earn those coupons um, as well as contacting their doctor so they can get coupons from going to the regular um, doctor's visits um, so yeah you need volunteers because then I'm thinking there's a third group of people watching that are like I just want to hang out with new moms and babies yes and um, we can always use volunteers we have a lot of opportunities throughout the year um, and so they would contact me actually mm -hmm. so you can go to that website and get that information um, and I would love to have you all right well we're gonna put the website up right uh, here in uh, just a matter of moments there it goes associatedchurches.org and uh, you can find out more about a baby's closet and all the different ways that you can be a part of that we will be right back here on Insight.